Howdy, howdy. This is Blue Otter, and today we are going to continue with Pizzazz Lantra, serve award-winning food, and help culinary students stomach the perils of fine dining. All right. For starters, welcome to Pizzazz Lantra, where you'll find cobbled stones and stunning cobbler. The students are eager to, prov to prove themselves in the town's famous cookery competitions, but a life on the stove can turn any aspiring chef into a perspiring chef. Will they wilt under the spotlight or does it make take a pressure cooker to make diamonds? So we have gastronomy. And of course we start with 10 students. Hello, I'm, hello there. I'm DJ Sue Chef. You'll find my restaurant and nightclub, Beetroot, right there, right here in Pizza's Lantra. I'm here to help turn your student body into a bodacious stew of learning. Welcome to the culinary world. It's going to be delicious. All right, so first things first, we need a lecture theater. So there's our Beetroot. Uh, we need a lecture theater, so we're going to come back over here. Um, I think I have... Now, I have several that are... Alright, so that is... that's just that one. Do I have... Do I not have... That's got heaters on it, which I don't even have. In there. Okay. We will. We're going to build our own lecture theater. Uh, we're going to start. Um, yeah, we're going to start right here. And we're going to. We have. Yeah, right there. All right, and then the doorway. Have a campus poster, trash can, all the essentials, and students are reminded uh, that they should I... be self-sufficient by now. Yeah, this one I've already got up, so we're going to have that one. And there is our lecture theater. Now we also need to build a savory kitchen. Okay, savory kitchen, uh, which needs to be at least six by six. No, not six by six. There. That is huge. All right. So we're going to have right there. And there is one thing. Do we have the ability to put... If we do have the ability to put things on one side. So we're going to... Put as many of these as possible in here. Now that one fit, but that's not to say that the others are going to fit. Uh, so let's put these back here. Uh, so we have numerous. So that's the one that we had before. And here is the recipe book, which we're going to put right up here. And we're going to, uh, we're going to unlock the culinary fridge. And we're going to put a fridge. 
right there. Towards that end, we're also going to put in trash can and sanitizer. And then for a decoration, uh, we have a container cupboard that looks like we have that. There we go. So container. And then there's one item that here we are. This is a food group poster. Plagiarism is not a belief system. Uh, so we're going to put that right here by the recipe book. And we'll also put a second one right there. Um, it is one of my favorite. That one and this electrical board. Uh, so that is our room for now. We might end up going back and adding more to it if more becomes available. And then we need a... So we ha we need a teacher. Um, both of the neither one of them are good or that I like. Uh, so I am going to I'm going to ditch both of them. Now I know I'm going to need a janitor, so we might as well go ahead and hire a janitor or two. And we're going to need uh that'd be good for a librarian. And we will have no, that's someone who's gross. I Okay. Let's see. Ben Linus. Okay, let's see who the next applicant is. I do appreciate the fact that even during summer these applicants are not uh, it's not frozen where you can't get new applicants um, so this is going to be one so we can get like up to three applicants here uh, I've already got a library alright so here is alright David Moose it is alright so that is our management. Now, I believe we have uh, 10 students, but what we're going to do is we're going to do that little trick of make them really happy. And then we might see 15. I would, I would be okay with. Is there any way to get to 16 now? All right. So we're going to 15. That's close enough. I think I could live with that. Students are reminded that it'll be over before you know it. Uh, so we're going to do a bathroom. Uh, we're going to do bathroom right here. Students are reminded. And we're going to place right there. So can we do that and one more sink there we go reminder to oh, invalid wall okay fine reminder to wash your hands and then can I do I can do a trash can there or can I can I do a trash can right like 
there. And then I can... Uh, we're going to do some square corners. Square pots. Alright. There we go. Awesome. Now we can kind of make this into like a little dormitory wing. Uh, so we're going to add a dormitory. Uh, now we only have... 15 students so we're going to uh, we're gonna start this all the way over here okay let's do Let's, okay, it just needs to be at least two by two. So we're going to have that, and then we're going to have the door there. We're gonna put one there, one there. We can have them. Hear the car going by, and then I'm thinking that that's my. It's the rain. There is the notice board. Um, and. That. Now, can we fit. Yes, there we go. That was so. So enthusiastic. All right, we're gonna have that there, there, and then we can each bed gets. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do teddy bear. All right, anything else that I would- yes, yes, yes. Frog friends. All right, everyone gets a frog friend. Uh, we're going to have ducks, that one, and then where is the other rug? There's the other rug. Okay. We have it like so. All right. And then I love two points. Right here, we'll put that right there. We'll save that for another one. All right. Um, yeah, that looks good. Now, that only handles uh, 10 students. Now, I could add a second course, or I could go ahead and make this. Yeah, we'll do that, where I will have 20 kids. Well, wait. Sixteen. All right. Now, what I want to do is we're going to duplicate this, but we're going to take all of that away. We're going to subtract this one. Add it over here, move the door right there. And so we can move this right there. And this is gonna go right there. All right. Then we 
have stars right there. The extra and then we asked questions. No, you can't have an extension. That's boring. So you have basically empty, you have a clock. I was hoping we might be able to get a different kind, but that's okay. Uh, yeah. Now we can do, so that gives us 20 beds. We'll be able to rotate them and have them up over here. And then let's build a shower room right here. And we're going to have two showers with a towel rack, a towel rack. Um, even though I'm pretty sure. It'll be fine. Uh, then we will have a sink and a hand dryer. Um, and then we will have two over here and then we'll be able to have everyone right there. Now, one thing I'd like to do is, uh, since we can add this, we're going to add a secondary door right here um, and I think I wanted to add the secondary door right there so which means I'm I would have to move this over uh, but we'll address that in a later time when it becomes necessary um, same thing with over here I'm just gonna build a secondary um, Lecture hall. All right. Next thing I need is I need a library. And that one we're going to put right here. And we're going to have a door right there in front uh, with the librarian is going to be able to be uh, right there. We're going to have that bookshelf there, that one there, uh, the fancy one we'll have right there. Um, I don't have the next one that I need. Uh, we can we have that there. Um, and we're going to put there we go. Now, some of this is going to be to give room. So I'm going to try to have like my books over here. Uh, so for that end, so we have the gastronomy bookshelf, but I need a hundred kudosh to do that. So I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to save up some, some money for that. Um, I don't know if they need that one, but I'm just going to put one in there just to be in case. And we'll do... Some right there for that one and we're going to have a small little reading nook over here uh, with there we go so 
we will definitely do that. Do I? I already have an assistant there. And then we're going to have right here at the front, we're going to have, this is basically going to be our Starbucks. And we're going to get our second, not them. We'll do thanks patience is a virtue. All right. So there we go. Um, I can't think of anything else that we need. So we are going to start the next year. Are you sure you want to start the following year with the following courses? Yes. Uh, let's just start the next year. So there is our. All right, listen, I get it. You want your students to flower, but their grades won't always be self-raising. When one of my chefs needs some help, I send everybody else home and talk to them slowly and loudly. Maybe that's extreme, but some extra attention can go a long way. I recommend building a, a private tuition room. All right, so we have unlocked the private tuition room. It needs to be a minimum of three by two. So we could have, yeah, we're going to have it just be a little bit bigger. Uh, and we're going to have the students going to come back there and then the teacher. Uh, no, you know what? I take it back. We're going to, we're going to. And I was trying to do this where it's... Okay. Alright. So we've got a cardboard. So we're going to move this over. This is an academic institution. Our bathrooms are co-educational. And there we go. we're going to have now this is fun because I usually spend a lot of time uh, decorating this particular room because there's just there's so much you can do with with this room Um, and then we're going to add a plant in the corner. But this one just has so much that you can unlock and put in that we're going to do, we're going to get some teaching manuals. And we're just going to uh, put them in right there. There we go. Like so. Uh, students can pretend private tuition for one-on-one -on -one help with a teacher. It's a great way for students to catch up or even race ahead. Private tuition sessions require a teacher to be qualified in the same course as the student is taking. Okay. So, since we're already on there. So, one thing that you can help with is here you have one that has just an extra bonus of that so we're going to have this person is going to exclusively be for uh, this private tuition so we have where they have classes and this person is just going to do private tuition and I'll do private tuition for that one but their primary is going to be on uh, teaching all right some of our things career goal student accommodations we have a hundred students move in awesome that's gonna get us some rewards obviously not as many as I would have liked all right so let's speed this up complete a private tuition session um, 
Okay, so my students are taking a bit of time. So I'm going to take him and I'm going to say go to private tuition. We're going to help this along a little bit. Assistant to the library. Thank you. And did I get Yeah, I did get an assistant that's a librarian. All right. Um, okay, so we're going to library person. Uh, library person is going to library. All right. And then what happens is you can copy the room. It's right there. And I will grab second chef. And they, even though they're not trained in tuition or tutoring, they can. Uh, as soon as I have a bland experience, don't expect their food to be any different. Show them a taste of time by throwing them a party. All right, so we have the student union, which we will do in a second. So here is, we're going to do this. Uh, so that way, two teachers are always over here. And I like to have for seating. I, I really like this one. This is one of my favorite ones. Uh, I like to offer them an extra seating choice. And then having some water. Uh, one thing I realized that I need is they also need some food machines. There's a cheesy gubbins, morsel men, and then we're going to have some seating right there. All right, student union. We are going to build a student union as uh, right about here. Yeah. And let's have the door right there. So here is our bar and we are gonna have some seating availability uh, right there. All right, um, we can even have a jukebox. And froggy friends. There's our school poster with a trash. You have to have a trash can everywhere. Um, I swear, this is like where the, the people from Planet Zoo come to school. To school. There's got to be like some professional class of like where to throw trash in the most most obstinate way possible. Um, okay. Do I have everything? Yeah, there's a lot more games and things that you can have in here. Uh, I think we're just going to stick with some of our basics. And I'm trying to make this because I don't know if because I think I'll probably end up having to have the stage and so I want to make sure that I've got plenty of room uh, for the stage when it comes into into play uh, everything yes okay I don't have room for that. All right, we don't have that. There is our student union. Uh, hire an assistant. 
Of course. Uh, so we are going to look at uh, not someone who has a gross or that one. Yeah, we're going to get a uh, violet. So there we go. Uh, events are a great way to promote a healthy work-life balance and the best way to make people happy. There's a lot of organized fun to be had on campus. Uh, so we're going to schedule and complete event. So we're going to have that. Um, and it is, there's, so we're going to repeat that every year. And usually I like to have these where they're for two months, but for this one, uh, yeah, we're going to do that, but we're going to not have it repeat every year. So we're going to book the event. How many students can we have in there? 15. Okay. Um, so there you have the laser lights. I do need a student lounge. And I'm debating if I should have, if I could build, I could build one right here. Um, let's go ahead as we're waiting on that to go through. Um, I do need to get 45 more kudosh so that I can um, I can unlock the gastronomy bookshelf which will be required for them to do assignments. having fun. Where were you storing that crock pot? Uh, so one of the thing about the party is, is that it kind of gives them a little bit of a boost. The party was a success. I've not seen anything like it in days. I'm sure the students will appreciate it. There's a wide range of events that you could run on campus, so don't forget to spice up the academic year. Uh, that's it. We finished the prep. Now all we can do is mix everything together and hope for the best. I can't wait to taste the students' cooking. Oh, didn't I mention I judge the campus cook-off? Good luck. So, funny film. So we can start setting up events. Uh, so we're going to have a funny film. Um, and we're going to... Yeah, we're going to repeat that every year. And I like to try to have as many things as I can in the interim between classes to give students options that will help to boost their overall. So here we have a movie starting up. Um, so yeah, so we need to hire another janitor. <laughs> While I look for, and I like, there we are. <laughs> so the movies are more of just come and go and they can come in, they get a boost and they leave. Love Bench Warrant. Now, since I've already unlocked it in the last one, my last campus, this is now available in this campus. So we're going to place those right like so. There. Um, I am thinking I 
I'm going to remodel the library. I might be able to get by yeah, without all that. So we're going to pick this up. Students, eating rubbish are reminded that you are what you eat. There we go. budget profit because uh, what we can do is we can pick this up and move that down there we go and then we can add uh, we can add a lounge it'll be a smaller lounge but we'll be, I'd be able to add a lounge right there uh, clubs are another great way to get students socializing and having sa savory time Students in clubs will also develop special skills. Place a power nap club stand to get people asleep on their feet. So a speed or a speed walking club station. So chefs can move like a hot soup out of an unlidded blender. All right. So we have clubs that we can place, which is this icon. And then you can have where students can nap or have a pick me up. Oh, we need a staff room. Some, there are some park benches and I literally just cleared this off for a staff room. Uh, three by two. Uh, we'll We'll make it like so. Uh, seating. And then let's go back to there. We have our lights. We have a place for some tea. We have easy gubbins. We also have there we go. but not least uh, we'll have there friends and then we'll do there we go it's pretty big staff room what is this? All right. Gastronomy, level up 100 gastronomy students. 
Awesome possum. Uh, what else have we got? Food chain. Everyone knows you can't make good food on an empty stomach. It's offering us a bonus to keep our students well fed. Yeah, I'll take that. All right. So that is a hundred. What was it that we needed to have? So we needed to win a campus cook-off. Um, so one thing we can do. Um, no, because I don't have a free time. So yeah, you do have to have at least that. So I like to have it. You can have it two, he, one here. Um, end of November early December or in like April okay yeah that's one of the uh, the weeds. So, can we do a student lounge? I am running low on funds. Um, so, I may want to be a little bit more frugal, I say, as I proceed to build another building. That's going to only allow nine. Um... No, that's 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 not where I was doing. Uh, what if? Okay, if that is nine, that's eight. Okay, so I need at least that many. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to have, um, yeah, we're going to have, you're going to go through a small kitchen area, like a little kitchenette. Um, and that is the end of the year. Uh, but so we're gonna click on that um, so we will finish the lounge at the beginning of next year let's see what we have okay so 100% pass rate academic excellence campus of the year so not bad after a very savory year it's time to cook something sweet a truly great chef is just for Familiar with sugar as salt, with butter as cheese, with tiramatsu as tender stream broccoli. Remember, food is about balance, except when it comes to custard. You can't have too much custard. All right. So that is the sweet kitchen unlocked. We will need to unlock another building for that as well, uh, which we will probably start moving some of our kitchen stuff into that. Uh, but we're going to do that uh, next time. Uh, so uh, thank you for watching and have a great day.